Hey, what's going on today, YouTube? So today's topic is how I learned to read hiragana faster. And so there are a couple of ways that I learned how to read hiragana faster. Um, but my the honest truth is that you've got to read and be exposed to a lot of hiragana to read it faster and faster. But I do have some tips on how you can perhaps maybe speed that process up. The first one that I have is it may seem a little bit obvious, but really focusing in on the hiragana characters at hand when you are reading Japanese or trying to read Japanese in the beginning, especially because in the beginning it just seems like a jumble of characters and a mass of just incomprehensible symbols. Um, at least for me, that's how it seemed in the beginning. And so once I got past that, I really focused in on the hiragana characters that I'm reading in, and that helped me mindset wise to um, focus in and memorize the hiragana quicker uh, after that point number two is if you're struggling to memorize hiragana characters um create an anki deck or some type of flashcard thing for it so um you know i'm a big advocate of using anki uh on this channel i've used it quite a bit in my studies and there's a big debate on whether it's effective or not it's definitely effective in my opinion um but for hiragana of course um you should only be using for about for a couple of weeks or for a month or so once you get the swing of hiragana you won't need to ever ever take a look at that hiragana anki deck one ever again once you're past that you're basically good with hiragana and so you can just delete that deck but i'll go ahead and show you how you can get a deck into anki um later after i finish up my third point and so my third point is finding content that suits you or is very interesting to you so in learning japanese of course you have to find content that interests you so this one may seem a little bit obvious but go find some content even if it's way above your level and just read it you can use something like yomi-chan a browser extension to read to read kanji characters or to turn the kanji characters into hiragana or you can find maybe furigana translations the goal here is just to read and expose yourself to hiragana so personally i watch anime with um, Japanese subtitles and to keep up with it I've got to be able to read the Japanese subtitles and that has uh, the kanji and hiragana and so that was one way that that is one thing that sped up my hiragana abilities to um, notice and perceive them and then additionally is right now is manga and so even if the manga even if I'm not understanding what words I'm reading I'm able to pronounce them and able to read them uh, because of the hiragana and the furigana characters. Um, furigana is basically just the hiragana readings of the kanji. And so it doesn't matter if you can't understand it, but if your goal is to read hiragana faster, you just got to expose yourself to it more and more. And so with that last point out of the way, I'm going to go ahead and jump into Anki and show you how you can also get Anki, um, how you can get a hiragana basic starter deck into your Anki. So let's go ahead and jump into a Google browser. And all you're going to do is search up hiragana Anki deck. And you're just going to click this top one right here. I'll have links down to the to them down below in the description. And you're just going to go down to download and download it somewhere that you know you can find. And once you've done that, you're going to go ahead and open up Anki. And so if you don't have Anki installed, I really recommend that you go install it. I have a tutorial on how you can do that also down in the description. So go take a look if you don't have it installed yet and you want to do the Anki reviews. And what you're going to do is once it's open, go up here to file in the menu bar, go to import, find where the deck, you find where you have the deck, just click it, uh, complete Hiragana practice deck, go ahead open it and you're gonna get this little you know finished message i already have imported it and so um here's the deck and so if you're new to anki um go watch some other, vi other videos on my channel i go into a little bit more depth on what anki is um especially the one that i linked down below in the description and you'll be able to see how you can customize modify and why I think Anki is just such a great tool. And so that is that for Anki. And so that's it for this video. Honestly, um, the f way that I got better at reading was by just being exposed to a lot of content that I personally enjoyed, and that made my reading skills much faster. Um, I can basically read them on site, and it's mainly due to just reading and keeping up with content that I like and enjoy in the language. And so that's it for today's video. 
good luck in your studies out there. Um, I will see y'all in a future video. And yeah, catch you later.